So here's how I got started. I began with a criminal justice degree, hoping to do uh, either criminal justice reform or something in the civil rights area. I moved on and actually did some work uh, in white collar crime investigations and uh, decided that at the time what I needed was more accounting and some computer science and some things like that that I didn't have. So I ended up going to business school, becoming uh, a CPA, getting my MBA and going into business consulting. My desire to help people was always there and I was always trying to find that way that I could uh, make a difference and and help individuals. I had been interested in coaching for a very long time, but at that time coaching wasn't really a thing. There was Tony Robbins out there doing it and that was about it. Um, so I, I had 15 years in corporate America watching around me the people who were unhappy with work and me myself searching for something else. Wasn't quite sure what that was, uh, but doing a lot of soul searching throughout my entire career. I loved entrepreneurs and those were my favorite people. They would walk in and their energy was just magnetic and fabulous and um, so I was looking at that as something that uh, I wanted to be an entrepreneur at some point and I ran some family businesses and decided that was the freedom that I wanted and that was the lifestyle I wanted and uh, that that was going to be my next move but I really didn't know in what capacity so um, the coaching had always been an interest of mine and all of a sudden coaching was a viable career option and so I decided to start my own coaching company and specialize in the area that I was really interested in which was work and why people do the work they do and why, they're, why they don't do the work that they really want to do.